So Calibria is, first of all, a tool to calibrate a system. Uh, modern systems are extremely complicated. We have many ports that we need to calibrate. We have a very complex network analyzers. We have a vast majority of the vector network analyzer vendors, and all of them are complex and very different to each other. Uh, different calibration methods, different types of the probes, and so on, uh, different uh, calibration tasks and uh, temperatures we need to calibrate a system, design of the calibration standards, uh, special calibration methods. All these requires a vast majority of uh, hours spent in front of the system if you want to complete your task successfully in a short period of time. Calibria helps to do it. Calibria is a layer, is an interface between the machine, your instrumentation, and the operator in front of the system, which does not require an operator to be an expert. Calibri helps everybody, even unexperienced operators, to complete the calibration task at the shortest period of time, instrument independent, uh, system independent, and also provides an access to smart tools which guide you through the calibration process, which analyze every step associated with the execution of the calibration process, prevents you from measurement errors or execution errors, and also enable you an access to other tools and other uh, calibration or calculation environments already developed by other people and available today. So it's an enabler and an important interface for any calibration and RF measurement task on the system. The technology and, uh, well, we observe the constant development of the calibration algorithms and the constant increase of the challenges related with the calibrating of the wafer level measurement system. So everybody wants to measure as accurate as possible, complete the calibration process a shortest period of time, and do the very accurate measurements at targets frequency ranges. So we knew that there was nothing available uh, on the market or there were no solutions available that people could use to calibrate the system. Uh, the traditional calibration software are designed uh, for experts and you need to spend a lot of time to understand how to set up the proper calibration algorithm. Some of them even do not have a direct access to the network analyzer and operate with uh, pre-measured data only and they give you calibration results on your computer only. You cannot push the error terms to the network analyzer. So we wanted to develop a tool and a platform which will help everybody to complete the calibration process in the shortest possible period of time with greatest level of the confidence. That was our vision, this is why we started this project. Multi-touch. Uh, we were lucky when we started Calibria project, actually for two reasons. The number one is that uh, we didn't have any legacy product that we need to support. So it's not uh, very often when uh, you already have uh, some expertise and experience and some visions what you really want to achieve with your product and you don't need to feed into already existing legacy product portfolio which very restrict and limits your capability to realize the ideas and your vision. At the same time, we started developing Calibria in the year 2013 when the multi-touch capability and multi-touch human machine interface was already available and developed. At that time, everybody had the mobile devices, phones and iPads, and uh, we just thought about why we should reinvent the wheel. Because everybody knew, even kids, they can barely walk, but they can already play with these devices. And those devices are extremely sophisticated and complicated. You can make a phone call, you can browse the internet, you can make a purchase, you can listen to the music, you can process your photo pictures. This is a vast majority of totally different tasks that can be executed on the very small screen. Why we cannot bring the similar user experience into the task of the calibrating measurement system? operating the prop system, automated prop system, and make it as easy as using your cell phone. The three main benefits of Calibria. The first benefit for the system operator is the usability. It's a multi-touch, single window operation user experience. So you're always focused on only on the particular task and a set of features related to a particular task which help you to execute this particular task in uh, successful and uh, pretend you from a possible failure. It's a single window operation so that you don't need to switch between different, uh, different windows, which makes a very complicated and complex uh, task of calibrating your, uh, your RF measurement system uh, simple and very intuitive. Number two, a set of very unique features 
which we incorporate in Calibria and also in Sentio related to the calibration process. Uh, we are focused on developing the tools which help uh, the people to prevent calibration mistakes, uh, set up the calibration process as quick as possible, and improve the calibration quality uh, by using a dedicated, a specially designed calibration algorithms which were not available from neither other calibration software nor from the network analyzer for panel. So that is accuracy. And number three is the open platform. We, uh, our vision is to enable an access for engineers, not only the tools developed by MPI, but also the tools developed by other people such as linking with the Python library for advanced calibration algorithms uh, de developed by other groups. This is what is available from Calibria. And also the open access to the database of the probes and calibration, uh, and, uh, calibration substrates. So Calibria uh, supports the probes not only from MPI and calibration substrates not only from MPI, but also from any other vendor. Because in the typical laboratory environment, you always see multiple types of the probes, multiple types of the calibration substrate. We help people to use what they want, what they prefer, uh, what is available on our systems. So Calibre is enabler and we see it as a helpful tool for everybody who is doing RF measurements and RF system calibration. Calibre is available for every RF engineers, so we do not charge for it. Uh, the license, however, we provide the license because we want to uh, keep you guys up to date with every new Calibre release so that you know that uh, there are some new functionality available, you can upgrade your system. We, it's not the not locked, it's uh, just a personal license, so you can use it and install the Calibre on any machine, on also uh, not only on the machine from MPI, but also on the computer, and use it in the manual mode and hook your computer to the network analyzer and have a full access for the features related with the calibration of workflow data analysis and so on and so on. So it's free of charge. Uh, to get the license of Calibria, just go uh, to a web page of uh, MPI and provide your contact information and we will send you the license information the next day. And it will be free forever. Uh, this is our uh, vision and this is our service to the microwave measurement community. We will, we will be providing uh, Calibria for everybody free uh, forever with every next update and even major upgrades. Uh, yeah, that's the free, this is the free license. Yeah, indeed, developing of uh, this very new user interface was not easy because uh, not only you need to have a vision what you want, but you also need to have um, a team behind of you uh, which shares this vision and uh, which has already an experience on how to realize this particular type of human machine interface and user experience. And remember, at the time when we started Calibria, there was nothing available in our domain. We only could look into the typical um, operational scenario on the mobile devices, but this operational scenario was not directly applicable. Uh, to neither controlling the probe system nor to the uh, calibration procedure. We spent a lot of time designing the graphical user interface and uh, we probably spent a half of a time developing the user, uh, user interface and another half just coding it and realizing all the features related with this particular uh, graphical user interface. And I can tell you some secret that uh, after we bring the very first version of Calibria uh, to the IMS show, it was back to 2014 when MPI introduced advanced semiconductor test business division. Uh, we were not quite happy with the result of, uh, of the graphical user interface. We saw that it was the right step and the right direction, but not exactly what we wanted. And after this show, we actually started over and we designed a graphical user interface generation two. And uh, you can imagine that was not easy to do and push it through the management staff and also through the engineers who actually uh, previously programmed the software using the typical uh, programming concept like one button, a Lovang function, one graphical, uh, one window, and uh, like one function, one button. Uh, but we've got there and uh, actually uh, since then we use the same concept unchanged as over, almost over 10 years and it just proves that our vision was, uh, was right. And uh, we've built a uh, centiographical user interface based on the expertise and the 
functionalities and some features that we developed on Calibri because Centio followed. We introduced uh, automated prop systems after the, our manual prop systems so that Centio used already and gained a lot uh, from the methods and concepts and architecture we developed uh, for Calibri graphical user interface. So we, we keep developing Calibria uh, with uh, three major goals in our mind. Our vision is to uh, make a complex task very simple, to improve the accuracy of the calibration process and to enable access to already available tools developed by other people, by, uh, by other groups. Uh, so that is in the direction where we uh, develop Calibria and uh, keep in mind uh, that uh, extending the number of the ports bring the calibration process in the multi, uh, multiple temperature environment uh, adds a totally new layer of the complexity in the calibration tasks. All these features related with the how to make more accurate calibration is the shortest period of time over the multiple temperatures with the multi-port configuration will be introduced in Calibria next, uh, next releases. Uh, and uh, we also keep the developing of the um, specific tools related with the on wafer calibration standards because we believe that calibrating with the custom made calibration standards on the wafer which are located next to your devices under test is the future. It brings much more accurate calibration results and measurement results of your devices, not only at millimeter wave frequencies but also over the multiple temperatures. And uh, there are a couple of new uh, cool tools from Calibria to come which will support uh, such calibration algorithms in the future.